All right, the next thing is a whiskey still. How the hell does that thing work, Ed? Well, let me tell you. Just said, Dave, hmm. Dave, do we want to go into the, the thermophysics of this, or do we just want to keep it pretty simple? Uh, I, I, I think when people are watching cable, you know, access shows, they're, most of them are either drunk or stoned. Yeah. Uh, we probably want yeah. to keep it simple, don't we? Yeah. So we don't simple. have people sitting there going, oh, man, oh, I think I'm going to die. I don't know what he's talking about, dude. So we'll keep it simple. That's good. Whiskey still. First of all, you got to have some kind of fermented, oh, let's use grain. And you take yeast, grain. Hey, can I be busted for this? No. No, okay. no, this is legal. This is legal. Okay. Yeah. Take some, say, corn. And some rye, uh, and some corn, and that the growing yeast, and sugar, and you mix it all together, and you put it in a gallon jug under your sink in your apartment. Move it when the landlord comes. Now, I'm, I'm not like trying to teach you how to do anything like this. I don't want anybody to try this. It could be dangerous. Move it before the landlord comes. Then you take this fermented product, which will smell something like uh, Dave Davalos's underwear after he's worn them for about three weeks. All right. So you take this nasty mixture and you put it in, oh, I'd use a plain old kitchen pressure cooker, okay? I'm not giving, like, instructions on how to do this. Though. This is illegal. This is illegal? No, this is not illegal. This oh, okay. is completely legal. Uh, okay. As long as you don't get caught. All right. It's legal. And you got your pressure cooker here. And you put your lid on. And it's got this stuff in here. Look, let me just stop now and put in a little disclaimer. Don't try this at home! And the little thing sticking up off the top, you take a piece of rubber tubing, one quarter inch to three eighths inch, that you get at the automobile shop. Don't try this at home! Stick that up there, you have a piece of copper wire. Don't use lead! Copper tubing, I'm sorry. Don't use lead! And the copper tubing comes up here, and you run it around and around and around and around and around. Then you take a radiator hose, which you get down at local automotive store. And there's your radiator hose. You have cold water coming in from your sink. Move this if the landlord comes. Cold water coming in from the sink. Run it down here. You stop off this end. You stop off this end. Cold water coming in. What happens in here? You put this on the stove. Don't try this at home! Heat this up. What's going to happen is this stuff is going to uh, evaporate. It'll turn into vapor. This thing that smells like Davalos' underwear is going to turn into vapor. It's going to come up through this tube. It'll be hot, man. I mean, it's going to be hot. It's going to come up through here. And you know, when your apartment's hot and it's cold outside and that water gets on your windows, it's called condensation. Don't try this at home! comes down through here, the cold water on the outside, the hot vapors on the inside, the hot vapor forms droplets, like on your window, dribbles down through here, comes out here, it's whiskey. The first batch that comes out of here is the most potent. Don't try this at home. 